2011 has been a year of ups and downs in the global economy. Uncertainty over employment, finances, and political stability have been felt the world over. Yet this year, through judicious management, Business Bermuda has hosted more events, attended more conferences, and conducted more one-on-one -on -one meetings than ever before. Actively telling the world that Bermuda is well positioned in this global web to provide financial stability through global interconnectivity. The support of our members, the Bermuda government, the Bermuda Monetary Authority, and everyone who continually gives freely of their time has proven invaluable to our continued success. Thank you. From our keynote speakers, panelists, those who have traveled with us to network at conferences and manned our booth, contributed to Nexus, and participated in our college student networking event, to the members and chairs of our first class committees and our members of our board, we thank you. All working together made 2011 a highly successful year for Business Bermuda, both internationally and locally, with over 45 events, putting our members and government officials in contact with no less than 9,000 service providers dignitaries, investors, and other leading figures. Bermuda's relationship with the United States, our largest market, has strengthened in 2011 as evidenced by our latest economic impact study. Bermuda is currently the most important export market for insurance services to the United States. Our relationship with the U.S. sustained over 300,000 jobs in 2010. These are just a few examples of the continually growing relationship between Bermuda and the U.S. Canadian interest in Bermuda has also grown with the signing of a tax information exchange agreement between the two countries. In the region, we attended three major events and hosted our highly successful financial services conference in New York and the Bermuda Day Briefing in Toronto. Every year, these events continue to grow and reflect the steady interest in doing business in Bermuda. In 2011, Business Bermuda participated in 10 conferences and events in the United Kingdom and Europe. Over 300 people attended our annual financial services conference featuring our Premier, the Honorable Paula Cox, as the keynote speaker. We also conducted our first thought leadership dinner bringing together a targeted group of journalists and business leaders to discuss Bermuda's significance in asset management. Continuing to build the Bermuda brand across Europe, in addition to London, we attended events in Malta, Monaco, and Geneva. Building on our expansion into the Middle East in 2010, Business Bermuda hosted and attended six events in the Gulf region in 2011. In the midst of the Arab Spring, Business Bermuda hosted a reception in Bahrain, then went on to also attend events in Dubai and Qatar. For the first time, Business Bermuda was invited to exhibit and sit on several panels at the reputed World Islamic Banking Conference. Continuing our work in Asia, we once again held highly successful annual financial services conferences in Singapore and Hong Kong. Over 300 government representatives, lawyers, financial services and fund executives, and journalists were in attendance. We also exhibited, presented, and held key meetings in the jurisdiction in a total of four events. Twenty eleven saw Business Bermuda extend our reach by venturing into a new jurisdiction, Africa. Following on the heels of the signing of a tax information exchange agreement between Bermuda and South Africa in September, we attended Hedge Funds World in South Africa, which proved to be a highly successful event. Over 250 delegates were in attendance, and the event was followed with local press interviews and meetings with representatives of the National Treasury of the Republic of South Africa. With some of the fastest growing emerging markets, Africa is a continent full of opportunity for international business in Bermuda. Business Bermuda, along with the members of our organization, attended conferences in Mexico City and Sao Paulo to ensure that Bermuda's superiority as an investment center was featured. At home, Business Bermuda has also been hard at work, hosting 17 events in 2011. 
Our committees continue to work with government on pertinent legislation and regulations for the business community. Of note, the Investment Funds Committee has worked tirelessly on the anti-money laundering policy, briefs, regulations, and other documents. The Trust Committee continues its focus on legislative change. Our Telecommunications and Technology Committee has followed actively the new policy changes and coordinated response from industry on these matters. Moreover, our Legislative Change Committee, together with members of the Ministry of Business Development, has worked continuously throughout 2011 and presented a series of amendments to the Companies Act together with other amendments, including necessary regulations to permit the use of Japanese unit trusts. These amendments have received cabinet approval and were tabled at the end of 2011. 2011 saw the conclusion of our first series of luncheon seminars designed by the Local Awareness Committee to bring the resources available in the international business sector to the general public. Every month saw 20 to 100 people coming out to participate. Our 16th annual college student networking event was the largest in history. With over 700 students, professionals, and members of government in attendance. As we look toward 2012, we build on the successes of 2011 to go out into the world spreading the message that Bermuda is open for business. We are excited about strengthening our relationship with our current members, forging new relationships with new members, and continuing to grow our relationship with Bermuda's government as we all work together towards promoting Bermuda as the world's preeminent financial services jurisdiction.